What if every engineering project over $1 million required majority approval from the communities it would impact, starting in 2025? Suddenly, engineers couldn't prioritize corporate profits over people's needs anymore. Massive highway expansions through black neighborhoods would face immediate rejection. Polluting factories near schools would never get built. But here's where it gets interesting. Engineers would be forced to innovate like never before. Communities demanding clean energy would spark breakthrough solar technologies. Residents rejecting toxic waste plants would drive zero pollution solutions. Transportation systems would emerge from grassroots input, not boardroom decisions. Black women engineers would finally see their community-centered designs implemented. Housing developments would prioritize affordability and accessibility over maximum profit. Neighborhoods would choose wind farms over coal plants every single time. This one policy change could solve more environmental and social justice issues in 10 years than traditional engineering has addressed in a century. All because communities finally got to say no.